and also knew at six it was a Hampton icon. But months after it burned to the ground, workers at Smitty's Better Burger say they're struggling to find new jobs. 13 News Now is there back in March when flames destroyed the longtime lunch spot. The owners still have no idea when they'll be back serving burgers. 13 News Now reporter Dana Smith picks up the story from here. It's been three months since Smitty's Better Burger closed down. You don't expect to go home one night with a job, wake up the next morning without one. The Hampton neighborhood staple went up in flames in March. I stood across the street. Whew. And it was surreal. Susan Roach's father, Paul Smith, first opened the drive-in burger joint back in the 50s. When I was in high school, this is where <laughs> Swear everybody hung out. For former employees of the restaurant, these past three months haven't been easy. My jaw just hit the floor. I couldn't, I didn't, it, it wasn't real. Ashley Sullivan has been out of work since Smitty's closed. It's been pretty hard being a single mother of two children. Another former employee, Jamie Bozen, has worked at Smitty's for 19 years since she was 16 years old. Sickening to my stomach. I cried my eyes out. Both Bozen and Sullivan have been struggling to find work. I have five kids. Three of them are mine. Two are, one's my niece and nephew. I just got out of foster care. They've created GoFundMe pages, asking people to donate money to help them until Smitty's opens back up or they find new jobs. I know my employees are struggling. And that's probably the toughest part. Roach says there's still no official timeline for the reopening but rebuilding efforts are ongoing. We haven't forgot you guys. In Hampton, Dana Smith, 13 News Now.